Hey yo, I was browsing Fiverr recently and I found this really hilarious um, gig where this guy was gonna make a ransomware for the encryption tool for you. And you know, he has here, he mentions that there's a, um, that includes a builder needed to make ransomware. So I think maybe it's like got some ransomware creator tool or something. Um, so, you know, I, th I thought this was pretty funny. Um, so I, I pretended to be interested in buying it from him, and after a while, I managed to get here. Um, where I pretended that I was like, oh, but what if someone could, like, reverse engineer it and find the thing? And he actually ended up sending me it, although he's deleted it now. Um, he ended up actually sending me a sample of his malware, which I have right here in this Windows XP VM. So, on here, I've got an important document, um, and a... Very important image, so you know these will get encrypted. Oh, I also have the um .NET Framework x86. You'll see why data. So, um, this is his man. This is the ransomware. So we're going to run these and our important files to be encrypted. So, so on that, and throws an error because he sucks. Um, but. You see now these files are called yark dot whatever, right? Yark dot A L G L O L which is this file. Um except it doesn't delete itself. It can't delete itself because obviously it's running, so we don't need that one. So that one's already we've already got the good version of that. So just these files now. Yark dot cute girls dying. As you can see this image does not work now. Um important document. It's all nonsense, you know, very important documents gone, and our .NET framework doesn't work. Okay, so, what you want to do, I'm just coming to my site, my GitHub page, um, go to decrypt A-L-J-R-O-L, here is the code, download it, yep. We'll save this to. Oh, let's put it in the desktop. Okay. So here it is. Decrypt A L G R O. So let's just move this onto here. So now I've got this. Um, requires the .NET 2.0 runtime, which is obviously why I have it on here. Um. So. Oh, let me put this. Let me just put this up here next to the ransomware. So you open it. Um, let's click on our cute girl sign picture. Okay. And, oh, good. Our, our picture is back. Um, what about important document? Can we get important document back? Oh yeah, our important document. It's back. Brilliant. Um, and the .NET framework. Ah uh, yes, it seems to be fine. Yep, working no problem. Okay, great. So now I can just delete these and delete the malware and change all that stuff back on back. So, oh, apparently your malware is, seems to be running. Yeah, it's still running. Now it's still running, so it's just kill the malware and kill it in task manager and then delete it. And that's how you that's how you clean up. And then you go properties, um desktop. Right now this is our wallpaper, um except I don't think the change actually worked. So that's that's a bug. But um just change it back to whatever it was. So yes. Um, right, stretch. Okay, there we go, and we're back. We've recovered fully from this ransomware. So, yeah, you could, um, that's basically it. Thanks for watching. Uh, yeah. Hope this helps someone who got this ransomware, like a val maybe a variant of it or something. Um, if it doesn't work, just send me the original, and I will... Probably be able to make it work. So, 
yeah show that